Hey guys, it's Caitlin. How y'all doing? I did a little shopping because I had a shower to go to today and clearly forgot completely how to hold my camera. So I apologize. We all going to see those black sides. But this is me. I went to Old Navy last night. I'm complaining about my pregnant gut. <laughs> um, so I went to Old Navy and then I did go to Marshall's, which I'll show a couple of items. But let's try this ish on. Um... This is a hell no, a hell to the no. <laughs> I feel like Old Navy has the same exact clothes like over and over again. Also, I'm super lazy, didn't take my jeans off at all. But I feel like Old Navy just has the same clothes. Um, sometimes you can get something cute, but I feel like they're like really matronly. Um, I don't know. I, I just didn't like it. So just showing you the silhouette, the back fat that my maternity pants are creating. I mean, life is just fabulous these days, right? But no, I did not care for this dress whatsoever. Um, let's see, what do we got? Okay, so this top I actually bought and I'm wearing right now because I wore it to the shower today. I figured um, it's really fitted in the bosoms. Oh my gosh. Really fitted in the boob area. And then it's super obviously flowy at the gut. This is like, these are straight sizes. So this is a large and old navy, like regular people. <sighs> yeah, I feel you, girl. I'm out of breath already too. <laughs> um, regular, not maternity shirt, but I felt like I could really grow into it. So I bought it and I really, it's very comfortable. Um, this one can, I feel like it could be cute. I feel like it was, you know, it was too big. It was an extra large. I don't know. I just kind of got mixed vibes from it. I was like, you know what? I could totally grow into it. Look at the gut. Like there's so much room, but I felt like this, the fabric was super busy and I don't know. I felt kind of like too momish in it. Does that make sense? Like I'm a mom, but I don't know. Yo, let's pause. <laughs> this was so weird. I don't understand the bell sleeve situation, like down in my forearm area. I just, it was, I felt like a sofa or something. I don't know. It was like super weird. I thought the pattern would be cute. Like the majority of it black and then floral, but I was so wrong. I felt like such a frumpy person right there and I could not do it. No, ma'am. Yo, this too. Oh, this was really tight on my boobs. I will tell you that being pregnant, my boobs obviously have gotten quite a bit bigger. Um, clearly my arms have as well, because it was super tight on my arms too. I think this was a large, um, I was looking for like empire waist things to kind of hit me in the right area. Cause as you can see, there is some gut situation happening, um, with this. Everybody yells at me. It's not a gut. It's a baby. It is. I get it, but it's still my gut. It's the way I see myself. <sighs> it is what it is. I didn't really care for it. So that was a no go. This cardigan that I tried on on top of it was $5, people. $5. It's like a super ugly mustard color, and I'm into it. Yeah, girl, $5. And I always wear cardigans. I'm always down for a cardigan. So I bought that. In a hot minute, I was like, yes, ma'am. Oh, yes, ma'am. So we went to Marshall's. Look at the new surroundings. Are you just blown away? This top, like, I'm into weird clothing. This top is super cute. Again, I didn't try on any maternity stuff because I'm just not into that. But this one was just too tight on my um, stomach area. Like I unbuttoned the bottom button and I felt like I was having to pull at it. But oh my God, I wish I got it because it's really cute. I'm into like the weird teacher, I don't know, school mom look and I'm into it. I like the ruffles. I love the collar, the tie. I didn't get it. It was only like $17. I probably should have, but I would have gotten makeup all over that collar in a minute too. So I liked it. This thing was super confusing. The top had some nice pleating right here, but it was like a two layer. So the top was super flowy and it was like connected at the bottom, but the inside piece, like I'll show you in a second where it's like cut off. It's right where the pleating ended was so tight. I feel like you can almost see my boobs being squished underneath there. I don't understand. I do not understand. The top was like flowy. The top half of it was flowy. The bottom section, like, yeah, I couldn't breathe life. I mean, life's rough these days, people. <laughs> Um, and then this top, I don't really know. I like the pattern. Like I really am into the black background with some floral. Um, I'm super excited for spring to be here sometime soon, but here's the deal. I don't know. And I love the collar. Like I said, I like the high collar. I love obviously lace. I feel like that's my whole life. Um, are these like lace top shirts? I don't know if I can do the cold shoulder. I don't know that I can pull that off. Um, also the bell sleeves, I feel like they hit me in a really, in a really weird length, like, oh, I just like totally punched almost a hole through their wall. Thank you so much. Um, but I felt like it cut, like hit me at a really weird length. Do you see that? I don't know. I didn't buy it. It is kind of cute. It was a little short, but it was definitely like flowy. So I could, 
again, grow the belly into it. So I didn't get it, but you know what? I feel like I might need to go back to Marshall's for that and the white top because I regret myself not buying it. But anyways, that's all I tried on. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you and I will talk to y'all later. Bye.